Hey guys, it's Trinity here today, and today I'm going to be filming my back to school supplies haul. Huh? I know I've been slacking on my back to school stuff. Like, a lot. Like, I've done zero back to school videos. That's because I haven't even gone back to school shopping yet, and I start school on the 24th of August and I need to start shopping and the only thing I've got is literally one pair of high-waisted shorts that I can't even wear to school but I did my school supplies shopping and yeah I need to get with my school supplies I might do it this weekend or next weekend I'm not really positive but yeah I'm like My Camelback water bottle is pink, but it looks like it's red. Okay. So, I'm going to be showing you what I got for my back-to-school stuff. Uh, I went to Walmart and Staples, so I'm just going to... I don't know what I got from where and, like, what, but I will be showing you. So, let's just start. I don't know where anything's from because it's all mixed up, so... Yeah. So, I got these Mr. Sketch scented Sticks. And these are just basically like the Mr. Sketch scented markers, but thin, and then I got the regular ones too, because I was like doing a poster for Nick Bean from You Now, um, and he's also from YouTube. Um, I was going to send him to his P.O. box, and I didn't have any markers, so I just had to use color pencils and stuff. But, yes. Next thing I got was I just had this in Walmart and Staples House, but it's really not even from there. I know what I got from Staples though, so I can just say I got this from Staples. So I got this pencil bag, which I got from Staples. It's from the BOC collection, and it's, I forgot the name of this, but it's just, it has a silver zipper and like silver stuff on it, and it's like mint green. There's two buckets here. Which I honestly, mm, I just got it for the looks. I don't know if it's really going to last or what. I'm probably not even going to use this as much as I would use, like, something else. Like, these pockets are very small. Hmm. I don't know. But it's from Studio C. It's really cute. And it's, like, has that, like, durable type of plastic and things. Oh, my God. This is the boring stuff. I'm going to get to the other stuff, like, after. This is a focus. Okay, so I got this five star paper in College World. They asked for Wide World, but I do not like Wide World at all. Like everyone does that, but this does that does school size hauls. But honestly, I just like really it doesn't float my boat. So I got two packs of that, and it's the five star one. And the five star one's really good if you like put it in binders because it has this like clear little. Mm, like wrap thing on it and it's it just like won't tear as easily and I got one pack of wide roll it's not nothing special it's from just from like Nurcom like what even is that it's like wide rolled paper I'm not gonna use it unless I actually don't really have to I got a white one and a half inch binder because I need one for language arts. So I just got this one. They have, like, they don't even have the like pretty colors of any Avery binders. So. Okay. I got my comprehension notebooks. Um, this one is from Walmart. But I also saw it at Staples. It's from the one hip chick collection from Studio C. I always buy my comprehension notebooks from Studio C. I just really like them. I'm buying like a lot of stuff from Studio C. Like all my notebooks I usually buy from Studio C. They're really great. And also if you use them for math, they have a cheat multiplication chart in the back. And then like conversions. And then in the front, it's just like parts of speech and punctuation if you use it for language. Um, but this one's just gold. My themes like literally blue and white. So I got a lot of blue and white stuff, and then it just like pops of silver and gold in there. It's like real cute. Okay, and then I have this one, which I got from Staples. It's from the Whimsical Flower Collection from Studio C. Then that one's that one. 
Um, it's just like a whole bunch of flowers. I thought this would be good for like science because it's like like nature and like I don't know. It also has the conversion table in the back. This one, oh god. This one is wide ruled, but for science, we don't usually like write in them. Like, we don't actually, like, write, like, stories in them or, like, anything. Like, we only do, like, a, a sentence for our warm-up and then, like, most of, like, tables and, like, we glue stuff in it. So, I got those. And let me just shove all this back in here. I should have just put it back in here right away, but I didn't. Next bag... This one, uh, okay. I guess I have a little bit of fun stuff in here. I got a white five star folder. Um, it's two pocket prong folder. It's like with brads. It's two pockets. Last year I had a really good one. I don't know what brand it was from, but it had four pockets in it. I used it. It was like full. Never broke. It was so good. I got two packs of dividers when I have one binder. They only ask for six dividers, so I guess I can take out like. I don't know, purple and orange or something at the bottom, but I'm not going to. I might just have this for extra. But there are two pocket insertable plastic dividers. So, yeah. I don't know why I got two packs, but I did. Okay. What is all of these? I don't know. Okay. I got a three five star one set of notebooks. I only needed one. I only needed one for Texas history, but yeah. I have this blue one, and then I got this purple one. It's like a fuchsia magenta color. It's really pretty. I got a white one, of course, because everything I own is white. Um, and then I got a couple supplies that are in this bag for some reason. I don't know why. I have this Boss Stitch Twist and Sharp pencil sharpener. It's blue and green, like my colors. And then I have this scotch tape. And then I have this compact mirror. It's gold. Hello, star love. And then I got these glue sticks, cause I don't know. And then I got these packs of pencils. Which I sometimes feel like using if I don't want to use my mechanical ones. And last year I had like zero for when I did testing. So, that's good. Uh, the other day. Yeah. Okay, and then now for the fun stuff, I got these markers which these are the bright colors um i got them last year they were pretty great and then i got these mechanical pencils these are just the big extra sparkle ones number 2.7 lead and then i got these papermate ones which these ones are always good they're the clear point ones and these are also 0.7 and i got two packs of colored pencils uh, cause I need them for Texas history and last year in world culture. I was ran out and my always broke. And then I got some Sharpie highlighters. They asked for yellow, but I got the colorful pack. There's smear guard as well. I got these pink pearl paper mate erasers. And then they asked for yellow post-it notes, but I do not like yellow post-it notes. I got these pretty color ones. They're like blue and pink and turquoise. And then I got these Sharpies, which these are just the fine point pen ones. And I got two packs of those. So. And then I got these paper mate, no, these Bic Crystal Extra Bold pens with assorted ink for 24 pack. They have like two of each, I think. So. And I got these pencils. Um, they're the white rose ones by paper mate and then the point seven I actually really like those as well. Then 
I got these G2 pens. I always like the G2 pens, so I got these. And it comes with a free mechanical pencil, which I've never tried their pencils, but yes, and these are the sorted color ones. And then I don't know where my other marker went, but I had one, but there's a hole in the back, so I only have one pink marker. The other one was periwinkle. Watch, it's on the ground. My Cleo's eating it. So here it is. So I'm going to end this video here. I hope you liked it. Like, subscribe, and favorite, and bye.